Guys, Namaskar, I'm Ronald and welcome back to my channel, The Bomb Connection. Guys, I'm back with another Toll and Twin video and I'm sorry that I'm a day late to react to this. This came out a day ago and I was very busy. I had to, you know, do some work of my own because I'm in college now. I'm studying again. Yes, I'm 24 years old and I'm pursuing my PGDM again. So, we are gonna understand what it is to feel. I should have studied before, but I had a four year gap and I'm studying again with younger people. I feel like a pedophile. Anyways, uh, my boring life aside, I should definitely get to this video because this is the relief I get after having a very super awesome tired day. So, yes. Here is my reaction to Dolan Twins writing dirty faction, fan fiction about each other. What? Okay. Hot for it. This is like the fifth fan fiction video they have made, and this time they're going to write about each other. I want to see the expressions on their faces when they do that, okay? So, yes, let's get into this video in 3, 2, 1, and go! Cool. We're back oh, okay. and today we are doing just knees on him. Okay, we're back and today we are doing say a little bit more people. We're back and today we are doing perfect. Today we got a book and inside this book we got a pen and inside the book inside of the pen We got some fan fiction that we wrote. We haven't made a fan fiction video in a little while So we decided to make a fan fiction video instead of reading some fan fiction from fans We wrote our own fan fiction Fan fiction, excuse me. We wrote our own fan fiction, but before we wrote our own fan fiction We needed a little inspiration. So we went on our phones and we read some fan fiction oh. Oh. <laughs> But we're not just gonna read each other's fan fiction because you know that would be pretty excruciating. But we're gonna make it a challenge. The rules to this challenge are that you're not allowed to make any expression. So while reading the other person's fan fiction about yourself, you're going to have to keep a straight face. If you laugh, cringe, okay. cry, throw up, you get a negative point. And whoever doesn't have the most points at the end wins. And the loser has to uh, do something do bad. something bad. We don't know yet. So who's gonna start? That's I want, the best I want part. You to start with mine. Straight face on now. Read the title. Face! That's a point for me. Okay. Oh my god, hands the in my face. <laughs> 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 okay, 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 it's not even funny. The first words aren't even funny. I was outside taking a walk on a chilly at late afternoon. I was hit with a gust of wind that hardened up my nipples. <laughs> <laughs> I looked down at them for <laughs> I looked down at them for a couple seconds and bent them down! <laughs> I look down at him, you know how they get nipples in the he's patting them down. Hey mama, I heard sp I looked up to see Grayson standing there covered in dirt up to his I looked up to see Grayson standing there covered in dirt up to his neck. I held my hand up for a handshake. Nice to meet you. He raised his hand like he was going to slap the shit out of me. He raised his hand like he was going to slap the shit out of me. He inched his hand closer and closer to my face as if he was moving in slow motion. He stuck his finger into the crack of my mouth. He then licked his other pointer finger and inserted it into my nostril. He removed both that his hands from, his, from my face. He removed both hands from my face holes and started massaging my cheekbones. I breathed a warm breath okay, in his face. Nice. I just ate hot dogs. I breathed a warm breath in his face. I just ate hot dogs. He squeezed my face, so I bit his <laughs> He squeezed my face, so How I bit can his he come up with This is not fanfic. This is just weird. I turned purple You're and really fell weird. on the ground. I he got on his hands and knees and picked it up with his mouth. <laughs> You're so bad at this. He stood up and backpedaled away. Look at me. You have a dead finger in your mouth. <laughs> What is wrong with you? Really? Nothing. What is wrong you, with you? I should have been weirder with my. I'm just a good writer. All right. A lot yeah. of negative points on my side. Yeah. My turn. These stories are only allowed to take up one page. Yes. That's that, a rule. That was the rule. Ethan, here's my story. Ethan under the bleachers. This sounds bad. You uh -huh. and your best friend went to watch your school's basketball team play on Friday night. During halftime, your friend gets up to use the restroom. You're sitting there alone scrolling on your phone when you suddenly feel a pinch on the bottom of your left thigh followed by a warm breath on your lower back. <laughs> a recognizable voice from beneath the bleacher says, you're thick as f mommy. <laughs> <laughs> it's Ethan. It was me. You let out a soft giggle, then ask, what are you doing down there, you goofy little meatball? <laughs> <laughs> Ethan answers, I was trying to take a nap, but then I smelled your perfume and I thought I should say hello. Ethan was a freakazoid. 
But that's what made him so sexy. <laughs> you whispered back down. Do you want one of my nachos? He said, <laughs> yes, of course. <laughs> I can't! I just picture, like, there's, a, there's bleachers, and just in the darkness under them, just <laughs> passing a nacho to me. I'm like, yes, of course. You handed one down to him. He ate it out of your hands and licked your fingers, cleaned up all the cheese. This turned you on. You began to feed him more and more because you loved it so much. When your friend came back, she asked, Why are you, <laughs> Why were you moaning and where... <laughs> Why were you moaning and where the crunching noise was coming from? But you kept that yours and he this dirty little secret. Oh my gosh. Feeding me nachos. <laughs> what am I, a cat? I'm like licking her fingers. It's disgusting. I'm pretty sure I'm winning. I, I'm, I'm definitely sure I'm winning. This is so bad, dude. But good. still, it's uh, funny. I didn't even cringe it's at funny. story. It wasn't even cringe. I just, I was just laughing because I was just trying not to laugh. But now I got the giggles out. I'm good. You didn't cringe at my last story? No, I didn't cringe once. Prepare for the next one. Oh my god, really you tell stories that have this one. It's really bad, and I was honestly just trying to cringe Grayson out, so you're just weird, that's why. Please don't judge me. Fifty Shades of Grayson. <laughs> Come on, dude, that's creative. That's creative, that's a creative. That's really title. creative. Yeah, like Fifty Shades of Grey, Grayson. I was laying on his bed in nothing but a room. I heard him gargling water from in the bathroom. Then he, okay. fireman, kicked the door down. <laughs> Turned around and ran backwards into the bed wearing nothing but a lime green <laughs> I just nodded everywhere. Read it, Grayson. Ew, ew. Sorry about that. Damn, my fanfic is powerful. He turned around and spit the gargled water in my face. I caught every last drop in my mouth. I fire hose. That's a face. Okay. I fire hose spat it back at him and he caught the murky water in a bucket. <laughs> He filled his mouth with the water and washed it around in there. He put a straw between his lips and I put the other end in between mine. I sucked the water from his mouth. Why are we playing the back and forth of water, Ethan? I sucked the water from his mouth. This is so gross. I feel the bits of food in it. Oh, Ethan! I I had the water now. I had the power. I had the water now. Okay. I have the power. I had the water now. I have the power. I held his eyes open with my fingers and spit the water in them. He smiled. <laughs> he smiled and high fived me. Thank you for helping me with my kink. Oh my god. He bowed to me and I ran. <laughs> he bowed to me and ran to the bathroom in his kink. I can hear him gargling the biggest mouthful of water. Yeah. Fifty Shades of Grayson. I'm so happy that it's not That's even the grossest shades, thing it's ever. It's just a kinky That's water spit game. That's disgusting, Ethan. So my That's kink in this, in this story dirty. is spitting literally water dirty. back and forth from mouth to mouth. That is the grossest thing I think I've ever heard. It's so nasty. Last story. Uh, this one's good. A beach Definitely day with the boys. Going you, to. Ethan, and Grayson headed down to the beach on one of the hottest days of the year. Seems kind of enjoyable so far, to be honest. Mm -hmm. Grayson was driving, you were in the passenger seat, and E was in the back. Ethan grabbed the aux and began to play Dynamite by Tayo Cruz. Okay. He then latched both though. of your shoulders and whispered into your ear, This song reminds me of you. Oh my god. Then he gave your earlobe a wet nibble and returned to his seat. This was extremely awkward <laughs> because you had been dating Grayson for three months now. <laughs> <laughs> we both nodded. <laughs> Something might be real. Don't nibble. Yeah. Don't nibble Once you all arrived to the beach and hopped out of the car, you noticed that Ethan was dressed to impress. Boy, did his ass look tight in that baby blue speedo of his. <laughs> probably looked real nice. While you were in awe, drooling over Ethan's ass, you probably were, Grayson said, I have to pee, I'll be right back. Gray then walked away, and with no time wasted, Ethan yelled, can you apply sunscreen to my back, please? Wait, he okay. It. Can you apply sunscreen to my back, please? You frantically agreed and grabbed the banana boat. You accidentally put too much on and it got really slippery. So slippery that Ethan Speedo fell down to his ankles. So slippery that Ethan Speedo fell down to his ankles and your hand slipped from his shoulder and slapped both of his ass cheeks. Gray came back That's to you covered in lotion. <laughs> A last sentence. Keep it together. Gray came back to see you covered in lotion and E with two five stars on his ass. <laughs> his jaw dropped. Alright, that is that's enough. 
That's enough. A weird part of me wants to keep going. Should we write one? <laughs> oh, here's one. I'll let you go for the Eating video. Eating honey, so, huh? I don't know why. You can write fan fiction and read it to yourself. Have fun. All right, fine. I have a kink. <laughs> I'm kidding, okay. Guys, thank you for sitting through that. Yeah, if you write fan fiction, thank you for writing fan fiction. And Grayson, I definitely won that challenge. Yeah, you probably yeah, did, I don't know. Yeah, he did. Therefore, you have to undergo a punishment. Should I gargle water and spit it in your eyes? No. Oh my gosh. gosh. All right, whatever, Grayson lost. I hope you guys liked that video. If you did, please leave it a thumbs up. If it made you uncomfortable, leave it a thumbs, a thumbs up. up. Yeah. Comment down below whatever you want to comment down below. Peace. Peace. And we'll see you guys on Tuesday. Yo! <laughs> well, this whole video was literally gross. Uh, I haven't been so uncomfortable and so cringy in any talk video so far. I mean, people show things to gross you out. They actually said a lot of things to gross me out. And Ethan was good. His fan fiction was good. Good in a very dirty way. Dirty in means literal di dirty sense. It was so gross. And that's why he cringed hard and I cringed hard. And I think <clears throat> he was lost. I would have definitely lost if there was something like that. What the hell? Gargling water on your face? You know? <sighs> really, guys? Really? <laughs> Ethan, really? Well, uh, I love the part where Grayson wrote the dirty fiction for him and uh, that was much more sexier, the last part, especially the last part, you know, the oiling down, oiling a muscly body, oiling a girl's body, everything, it's always sexy, okay, I cannot deny that, I cannot deny that, me and man, I know that how much it, that is sexy and, uh, well, that was all. That was my reaction. I actually enjoyed it much more than I expected it to be. I mean, at first I didn't have any kind of expectations because uh, I didn't know what they were going to write about each other. But now that I've watched this, I don't know why I didn't react to it before. Probably because I was very busy. But now that I reacted to it, I had a great time. I actually forgot about my stress and tiredness. So yes, I'm very happy. Guys, I hope you enjoyed my reaction. This was my reaction to the, to the Dolan Turn uh, Dolan Pin video. If you guys liked it, then please put a thumbs up, comment down below your thoughts and suggestions, and please subscribe to my channel if you're a new viewer. I'll be seeing you again. Until then, keep spreading the love. Ciao.